Welcome back, lovelies. It's that time of the month. It is time for our boxy charm. I'm pretty sure by the size of this, this is our premium box. If you would like to see what I got in my box and what my thoughts are for the premium box for the month of September, then please consider subscribing below. Ring that bell and leave me a like if you enjoy my video. And please comment down below. Let me know what you thought. Sorry, I forgot to take those off. Let me take them off real quick. I was doing a video before this one where I had to swatch. One second. Okay, swatches are gone. Let's get into the box. You guys... You're gonna kill me. I thought I'd been recording this whole time. I'm on to my third product. So first we got this. This was from Complex Culture. Okay, it's a face massager. And Boxy says that this sonic powered tool delivers a modern facial massage to increase blood flow, reduce puffiness, relieve facial tension, and help tone facial contours. Give yourself the daily luxury of an at-home massage to temporarily smooth and sculpt skin. Rejuvenate and sculpt your skin in just a matter of minutes whenever you can squeeze it into your routine. $58. Doesn't even come with the battery, but I could not figure out how to get to the where the battery goes because it's just this block there. So figure that out later but I'm guessing it just vibrates and you all over your face and you turn it on and off down here so there was that the next thing we got I was excited for it is La Rock setting powder in vanilla it is made in Mexico and Boxy says that this ultra fine cashmere soft powder gives the illusion of an airbrushed flawless complexion. The multi-purpose airy lightweight formula blurs the appearance of pores and fine lines, sets and corrects under eyes, as well as brightens for the ultimate glow while holding makeup all day without flashback, which is good, no flashback. Set, bake, and brighten without drying or settling, $30, which isn't bad when you think of Laura Mercier and other places. So, Let me do a little swatch for you guys. It feels so silky, you guys. Like, I cannot wait to use this. It feels very light and airy, but very silky. So once you have it on, it literally feels like velvet. It reminds me of my favorite one from Siate, London. It's the all everyday vacay. I'm pretty sure it's Seattle, London. Love that one. And this is the next thing I found that was close to it. So I'm excited. And this was vanilla. It has a very cute, whoops. There we go. It clicks in place. When you open and close it, it's very cute. Oh, and it has 23.7 grams. So we got that. And I just pulled this out when I noticed that we were not recording. This is the Laura Mercier Soothing Eye Makeup Remover. And I was telling you guys, this is the only eye makeup remover I use. The oil-free eye makeup remover from Neutrogena does not really have a smell at all. The only eye makeup remover I can use, no matter how much makeup's on my eyes, they will not burn and sting afterwards. Then there was this. How cute is this? Clear into blue and I shook this up not even three minutes ago watch how it's gonna instantly almost instantly go back you can see it's already starting see look that's pretty cool but let's see what this smells like doesn't have a smell I'm very excited, but I did want to mention, this is 5.5 fluid ounces. This is 3.4 fluid ounces. This is $27. This is $8. But let's see what Boxy has to say. A gentle eye makeup remover that effectively removes eye makeup, $27. So I'm very excited to give that a try because I'll be the judge if it's soothing or not. 
because I have very sensitive eyes. And if it burns my eyes, it's definitely not soothing. Tan Luxe Super Glow Hyaluronic Self Tan Serum. I'm not much of a tanner, but well, let's see what Boxy says before I open it. It says Tan Lux Super Glow Hyaluronic Acid Self Tan Serum. The first hyaluronic superfood self tan serum, your best skin day ever, bottled. It combines a high weight hyaluronic acid and extremely low molecular weight sodium hyaluronate. This enables multi-level instant and lasting hydration, leaves skin looking and feeling firmer and more radiant. With 4% DHA tanning activates for daily use. The innovative formula is derived from organic rape, rapeseed oil plus seven superfoods, $49. I don't need this. I don't tan. Like, I'm going to have to look up on this. Like, does this actually tan your face? Or is it like a barrier for before you tan your face? Apply 4 to 12 drops directly to skin, massaging circular motions and avoiding eye area. Additional drops will increase depth of color. Yeah, I won't be using this. So I'll go ahead and put that in the giveaway bin. Maybe one of you can get some use out of it. Next. Is that it? No. We have Hey Honey Trick and Treat Lip Balm. Berry Balm with Natural Tint with Nourishing Benefits. Apply, Kiss, Repeat. Uh, what shade? Like, does it have a shade name? Well, it's this color. Is it Berry? Is that the shade name? berry balm or are they all I don't know but anyways boxy says that a berry lip balm formulated with rich emollients like castor oil sorry castor bean oil and honey to keep the lips hydrated repair chapped and dry lips and provide a beautiful tint to the lips $23 I will gladly more than gladly take this and use it I love the balms for my lips Oh, it is pretty. Can't really try it on because I have this on my lips. And it's been on there for two videos already. So it's going to stain. But let's just see. Oh, it's weird. It's like... Like jam. That is weird. Very pretty though. There's a little bit and there's a difference between a little bit and a lot. So yeah, that's something weird. There, I added what was left on the lid to make it a little darker so you can see how it builds. But it's so, like, it's, it smells good. It smells like berries mixed with a tiny bit of perfume. But I am more than happy to have this. Let me wipe my hands off. So, again, there's what it looks like. It honestly feels like jam out of the jar that you spread on toast. That was weird. So I'm guessing we have one thing left. Yes, this is our last thing. I, 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 you guys, I look at spoilers. I can't help myself. That's just, I do. And I wanted to get this so bad and I got it. And I'm so happy if I can get it open. The Beauty, Beauty, the Beauty Bakery Milk and Honey Highlighting Palette. Look at that packaging. How cute. Before I open it. Beauty Bakery Milk and Honey Highlight Palette. So creamy you don't need butter. You'll be all the sugar after your milk. That glow with these silky smooth milk and honey highlighters. 
Grab your bakeware and strobe mix or layer in abundance. $38. Look how cute. It's got milk and honey stamped there. So you got like a deeper one, like a pinky purple, a white shimmer, and like a golden champagne one. But that's nice that there's a deeper, you know, there's deeper and lighter ones. I like that. They feel so smooth. Here's the darker one and the pinky purple. Now we're doing these two. Wow. Oh my good gosh. Seems like the two bottom ones are more sh like out there and the two top ones are a little more subtle. So, tell you the name, starting with that one. We have Oh Honey, Queen Being, Spoiler Alert, and Be Sweet. Gorgeous. And these are huge. Like, it's gonna take forever to hit pan on these. And this is made in China. Okay? Oh, and I didn't tell you where this was made. It doesn't say. Yeah, it doesn't say, but that's okay. Let's do a little recap. We got the cute rose gold face massager. We got the Lorac face powder. Ooh, this feels nice and matte. And vanilla. We got the Laura Mercier Bougie AF freaking eye makeup remover. We got the Berry lip balm we got the milk and honey by beauty bakery highlight palette and we got the super glow face tanning serum so what do you guys think let me add this up and i'll tell you what this box was worth my box that i paid 35 was worth 227 dollars and I liked everything. And I would have liked the serum if it wasn't tanning because I don't tan at all. My face, my body, nothing. So let me know what you guys thought of this box, please. What was your favorite item? And have you got your premium yet for the month of September? Or do you even get Boxy Premium? By the way, Boxy Premium is $35 a month. You have to get the base box first, which is 25. Then you can sign up for the premium. Once you're accepted, you could drop the base box or you could keep it like I do and get both of them for $60. So I'm very happy with my box, with everything I got. So let me know what you guys thought. Please leave a comment down below. It is late, I'm gonna get out of here and I'll see you lovelies in the next one. Bye.